The Security Exchange and Commission Sues 5 in BitConnect Scam This article was written by Leo Jacobson on May 31, 2021 at CoinMarketCap.com If your first introduction to cryptocurrency was via John Oliver's March 12, 2018 Last Week Tonight episode, you remember BitConnect well. Oliver's far from flattering report used footage of one of the project's big events as its source material for the overhyped and, at the time, financially disastrous cryptocurrency industry. Three years later, the Securities and Exchange Commission has finally taken formal action, suing five people for violating securities law by selling the BitConnect token, which the agency calls an unregistered security. BitConnect was, at the time, a failed and suspect project that has since been called a probable $2 billion Ponzi scheme by the likes of Galaxy Digital's Mike Novogratz, Ethereum collector Vitalik Buterin, and Litecoin creator Charlie Lee. Using emojis for ducks, Lee said, I follow this rule of thumb, if it looks like a duck, walks like a duck, and quacks like a duck, then it's a Ponzi. On May 28 On May 28 the agency sued promoters Trevin Brown, aka Trevin James, Craig Grant, Ryan Masson, and Michael Noble, aka Michael Crypto, with illegal securities sales. Joshua Jefferson, who the agency said served as a liaison between BitConnect and promoters and represented BitConnect at conferences and promotional events, was charged with aiding and abetting those sales. We allege that these defendants unlawfully sold unregistered digital asset securities by actively promoting the BitConnect lending program to retail investors, said Lara Shalov Maribun, the SAC's Associate Regional Director for New York. We will seek to hold accountable those who illegally profit by capitalizing on the public's interest in digital assets. The SAC is seeking to form them to disgorge, turn over, any earnings plus interest as well as pay fines. After commenting just when I thought life was getting a little bland, in the first of several tweets, Hourglass Crypto founder James pushed back, saying, Real crypto OGs will rally around me. The real ones that know the truth and what happened from day one. If you like this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and click the subscribe button as these would really help our channel grow. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in our next one.